What's going on, everybody? Welcome to Married to Film. I'm Ralph, and this is Shamanda. <laughs> Wrapped up like a burrito. Right. <laughs> right now, we're at episode three of season two of Attack on Titan. This one's called Southwestward. That's what it says. Yeah, West West, y'all. Yep. All right. <laughs> uh, thank you for clicking on this video. Uh, please like, share, comment, and subscribe if you feel so inclined. And share. Right. Um, this this thing is just captivating me, and I'm ready to get going. The less talky? Less talky. <laughs> Let's go. He went back? This is where it ended. Connie, have you found any survivors? Oh, they were already talking about that body, though. No. It's, it's in ruins. My hometown has been completely wiped out. Hey, something's wrong. Can you find any bodies? No. No, not yet. How is that even possible? Titans ransacked this place and there's not a speck of blood? They must have fled. The villagers, I mean, they all escaped. Uh, your family, too. You think so? You think they're alive? Oh, she's talking to him. Um, yeah, she's sure. giving them hope. The only logical explanation provided be no trace of, well, carnage. Right. I don't know that I agree with that. Suppose the entire village was evacuated in time. How do you explain the devastation? Why would Titans rip apart empty houses? And that doesn't bother me half as much as the stables being full. Without horses, the village's odds of survival are slim to none. Anyone not have a torch? Okay, let's move. Our mission is to evaluate the breach. Sir. Is he gonna wake up or something? He might blink. As if he was laughing. Did I? You better run. Snap out! Right. We're falling behind Jailgirl and the others. It sounded like my mother. Damn it, Connie! Do you even know how serious our situation is right now? If we don't see this through, people will die in the hundreds of thousands. Like his mama. So maybe the Titans came from the houses. Came from out Stay of the focused. houses. Stay focused. Like they've... I'm a soldier! We've raised the alarm for everyone in the region. Now we pinpoint the breach. The idea is to ride along the wall from the west till we do. Oh, Seriously? You know Krista and me don't have our battle gear, right? What are we supposed to do about Titan? The south will be crawling with them. If we can't defend ourselves, you ought to just serve us up on a platter. Well, part of the job is also have the right equipment for the job. Mm -hmm. Hey, no one made me join the scouts, and you know it. I chose it for myself. Uh-oh. I know it's a different story in your case. What? You think I signed up for all this crap because of you? What other reason do you have for being here? You tried talking me into joining the military police till you were blue in the face. You bowed out so I'd be eligible. Don't try to deny it. I wasn't good enough to make the top ten on my own. Ask anybody. When it comes to skill, you're the better soldier by far. Why do that for me? My family? That's it, isn't it? Sure. Why not? <laughs> He's the target is in range! Oh, they got no trees out here. Oh. Oh my god, y'all gonna be surrounded. Have we ever seen him at night? No. They say they don't come out at night. I can't take this. <laughs> then I freaks. Nope. Any second now they'll lunge at us from the shadows. They get their energy from the sun. Damn it. The closer we get to <gasps> the mystery point, the more it feels like we're marching into the jaws of death. Oh. His imagination. <sighs> 
Hello. Hi. So you followed the wall here too, I take it? That's right. I assume you found the breach then? We didn't see any irregularities along the western route. Surely you must have seen something in the east. Mm. No. The wall's perfectly intact. <laughs> well, maybe we just overlooked it. Not likely. If only we had more light. Well, don't ask for that. Well, here you go. Hmm? Look at What's there. That? More light. An old castle. It's a hardened piece of skin left behind by the female titan. Skin. It didn't vanish? No. This random fragment broke off when Annie reverted back to her human form. It didn't evaporate. It didn't simply go poof. So that got me thinking. And when I compared it with the sliver of the wall, its texture and composition were, for all intents and purposes, virtually identical. In layman's terms, we're hemmed in by a barricade of enormous titans. Mm. If my hypothesis is correct, the surface was constructed using consolidated titan skin. You're kidding me. That's what Armin was trying to say. <gasps> so then the Easy! It's rude to steal someone else's thunder! As it stands, we'd be hard-pressed to find a rock big enough to plug while Rose. Picture Aaron utilizing his hardening ability while in titan form. He ain't never did it! The stage should done be it? composed mm. of the same material. And the hardened bit won't dissolve once you've transformed back. This might be less of a long shot than it sounds. Thoughts? Th I do. Yeah. Right here. <laughs> I got thoughts. Well, anything worthwhile incurs a little risk. If we can manage to shore up Wall Rose, Wall Maria starts to look fairly promising. And what if we decided to carry out our plan in the dead of night? Night? Yes. When the Titans are effectively motionless. <sighs> That's not bad. In fact, it's genius, particularly if the group is small enough to slip by undetected. The whole plan hinges on whether or not Aaron can seal the hole again. Again. Not it's, a boulder. Uh, probably unfair of me to even ask. But do you think you can? You either will or you won't. Uh, yeah, that's true. That's the reality. Our comrades are breaking their backs. But without you, it's nothing. Mm -hmm. Failure isn't an option. Sir! I know! I'm prepared to do whatever it takes! That's a promise. My father's cellar. That's where the answers are. You gonna finally go there? The truth in what he told me. Can we go? It depends on us making it there. This is what happens when the walls give. No. Take it in, holy man. These are the faces of human beings who've lost everything they ever had. So, seen the light yet by any chance? Oh, God damn it! Make up your mind! This isn't some spiritual test! Lives are on the line! Alas, I have no choice. Alas? Neither myself nor the others who believe are at liberty to divulge the truth. That lot of help you are! Thanks for keeping us company! It's been fun! <laughs> I'd offer my help if I could. What okay. a duty as great as this one is beyond me. What I can do is provide you with a name. An individual the sacred will and its divine wisdom instructed us to monitor. The monkey beast! <laughs> it's a person you know. Someone who enlisted with the scout regiment as of this year. A child by the name of... Important message! I'm with the 104th Cadet Corps! Oh, and my name is Sasha Bruss! <gasps> no way! Who? Sorry. This is for you, Section Commander. You must find her with all haste. She is the key. She may know things we understand, but poorly. And with that, we come to the end of what I'm free uh, to share. If she's in the 104th Cadet Corps, she's at the front lines by now. Then let's go! Come on! There's no time to lose! That's where you're going! I was sent to give a message to Commander Ervin, who then entrusted me to deliver this to you, Section Commander! Oh, uh, okay then. Excellent work. Uh. Awesome. <laughs> what are they talking about? She was the smallest one in our class. Golden hair, blue eyes. In fact, she's a... Kind of cute. The girl who's always hanging around you here. Uh, excuse me? How can you read this? Amir, do you... Everyone, wake up! Into the tower immediately! Oh. See them in the dark, but with the moonlight. The sun went down.
went down hours ago. There go that one. Mm -hmm. What's going on? Hey guys, the hell is that? Beast man. It's gotta be a titan. Have you ever seen one that big? Sit down and shut up. It's more like some kind of beast. How do we? Shut up. Wait, is it? Is that for the wall? That's the plan. Are we clear? Yes, clear. Right. We have to go now! Calm down, Aaron. We're going our separate ways. That's how it has to be. Mm. Irvin had his reasons for throwing this ragtag squad together. Uh -oh. But right now, this is all riding on you. Armin, you and Hanji are the brain trust. Use your combined knowledge to cook up some kind of solution. Right. Yes, sir. Mikasa, I don't think I'll ever get why you're so attached to the guy, but... Put your skills to good use. Protect Aaron at all costs. Always. Sir, I intend to. And you. I'm doing it wrong. Don't screw no. this up. Oh, maybe it is. Oh my god. Hey, hey! Back off! Ah, uh, you ain't telling to back off? You ain't got no weapons? Oh my god. You nothing better to do! Father, someone else! I should be drinking right now, damn it! You're standing between me and the tanker of air! I've earned the right to get trashed! Please, <laughs> stay where you are. We've got this. Let the ODM gear do what it was designed for. Okay, well, I just need you to hurry up and get it for the, the monkey keys come back. Come to blind rage, all hope is lost. You can't afford another mistake to be continued. Sir! Oh my god. Part of an abandoned fortification to the southwest. We arrive with all haste for Utgard Castle. I'm gonna need you to go ahead and fall. See, who's restrained? So, what's <laughs> you said a little bit. A little bit. Okay, we're here. They <laughs> found a piece of the uh, skin, the diamond skin, from the female Titan, and in, in her, uh, her. Well, Armin had already deduced, I believe, but uh, what's the girl, the, the scientist? Hanji. Hanji. Yeah, she deduced that that was the same skin that it was uh, used to. Uh, uh, to protect the Thank Titan. You. Thank you, in the wall. But, go ahead. When she wanted uh, uh, Aaron to be able to do the same thing, to plug the hole in the wall. But we've never seen him have that ability, though. Unless we missed it in that last fight with the, the female Titan. Right. I thought that he did form it. But I thought I was just seeing things because my eyes was dirty. My <laughs> eyes was dirty. My glasses were dirty. But I thought that I seen him do it, but... I've never seen him do it, so why would they expect him to do something that he's never done before? Right, right, right. Or maybe he has done it, and that's why they're asking him to do it again. Right, right. We missed it. Yeah. Dang, we missed it. If that was the case, go ahead, baby. I'm sorry. And also, Connie thought that he heard the one Titan that was uh, barely formed. Uh, he thought it said... Sound like his mama. His mama, yeah. But I know that doggone thing was talking. I know he ain't crazy, even though the dude said he was crazy. He I was thought he said he was up. laughing. I thought the thing was laughing. It said something. It did say something. But this that doggone beast titan just scaled that wall like it wasn't no thing. I mean, he has a orangutan hands. And the man, he, he like a hundred <laughs> feet tall. He has orangutan hands. Yeah, yeah. But his head looked like the little thing from off of, uh, like Beetlejuice. How that grown yeah. man had the little head. Mm-hmm. Him. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Um... So the priest gave a little bit of tea. Oh yeah. Which he should have provided while he was on the daggone wagon. Yeah. Um <laughs> when they was yelling at him, told him. Yeah. But he said 
if anybody has answers or you may have to find the answers from the little girl who was riding on the on 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 the horse mm -hmm. with oh crap boy. I can't remember the name. The brunette. Mm -hmm. She was riding with her and she said um I know it was you that was that was trying to get me you you were blue in the face telling me that I need to be part of the police and all this kind of stuff and blah 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 blah. And then she said that it's it's from it's my family, isn't it? And she said, No, don't worry about that. If it's if if I'm gonna be worried about anybody, it's gonna be myself, basically. That's what she said. I'm paraphrasing. So she made she was trying to make her feel better, but Ralph did catch on to something. He said, why she look like that? Mm -hmm. Why her eyes like that? I was like, maybe it was just because she wanted to make her feel better going toward what they were getting ready to handle, you know, as far as, like, going toward that um, obstacle or whatever, you know, facing the Titans. Mm -hmm. But I don't know. So skipping to another part, we said we was going to do it quick. I can't do it quick enough, evidently. <laughs> the, they had two groups, and they were all riding in the dark. It was It was nighttime. And they were like, well, we need some light. <laughs> and I, I knew that little beast monkey was going to come out. So all of a sudden, the moon, mm -hmm. the clouds uh, separated, and the moon came out really, really bright. Full mm -hmm. moon. I said, that's a full moon. That daggone beast monkey going to come out. Monkey beast. <laughs> sure enough. Sure enough did. He did, once they got to the little torn down castle or whatever it was. And when they didn't, they didn't see the the monkey bees first. They see all the titans, and they said, "Well, dang, maybe the titans were moving all along. We just didn't see them." Because by the time they saw them, they were all up they there, like right there. they were like this up on the wall, like the last one, right. like the last time we seen them with the beast monkey, monkey bees, monkey bees, monkey. I beast. think that's why I keep saying monkey bees because it sounds like that. Beast. <laughs> That's right. it. Let's go. All right. Let's go. Let us know what you guys thought of that one. We'll see y'all next time. Love I'm it. sorry. Bye.